Have you heard of the classic of Shan Hai Jing? This is the most mysterious ancient Chinese book, which records countless strange mythical beasts. Some of them are fierce and powerful. Some of them are kind and auspicious. Some of them are shocking and horrifying. Some of them are hidden in the abyss. Today we will rank the top 10 most powerful mythical beasts from the classic of Shan Hai Jing and see their images, characteristics and legends, as well as who is stronger between them and the popular Western King Kong and Godzilla. Are you ready? Let's get started. Number 10. Jung is a fierce beast with the appearance of a red leopard, five tails, and one horn. It appears on the Zhangyi Mountain in Shan Hai Jing, where there are no plants but only rare treasures. It is said that Jung can conquer four beasts under the sky, making it a very powerful divine beast. If it fights against King Kong or Godzilla, it may attack their vital parts with its sharp teeth and horn. Number 9. Zhu Yu is a monster that looks like a monkey with a white head and red feet. It appears on the Shaoqi Mountain in Shanghai Jing, where there is more white jade on top and more red copper underneath. Although Zhu Yan does not look very ferocious, it is said to be a harbinger of war. Whenever it appears, a great war will happen in the world. This may indicate its ability to arouse people's fighting spirit or provoke conflicts. If it fights against King Kong or Godzilla, it may use its cunning tactics to sow discord or create chaos. Number 8. Chang Chi is one of the four ancient fierce beasts, resembling a bull but covered with spines. It appears on the Guishan Mountain in Shanghai Jing, where there are no plants but only gold and stone. Chang Chi is extremely cruel and evil, liking to eat people and always devouring the side that is more righteous and kind. It also likes to encourage people to do evil and can control evil energy. If it fights against King Kong or Godzilla, it may use its powerful demonic power or tricks to trap them. Number 7. Nine-Tailed Fox is one of the most famous fairies in ancient China, with legends in many cultures. It appears on the Qingchu Mountain in Shanghai Jing, where there are many cultural relics. The image of the nine-tailed fox is a fox with nine tails, sounding like a baby and able to eat people. But Shanghai Jing also states that eating the flesh of the nine-tailed fox can ward off evil. The remarkable thing about the nine-tailed fox is that it can transform into a human form, deceive sentient beings, and even affect the fate of a country. For example, Daji and Function Yanyi is a transformed nine-tailed fox who caused King Zhou to be licentious and led to the downfall of the Shang dynasty. If it fights against King Kong or Godzilla, it may use its beauty or wisdom to seduce or deceive them. 6. Baze is a famous mythical creature on Kunlun Mountain. Its body is snow white and it can speak human language and understand the feelings of all things. It rarely appears in public. It appears on the Kunlun Mountain in Shanghai Jing, which is the capital of the Heavenly Emperor. Bayes knows the secrets and weaknesses of all strange things between heaven and earth, and is willing to tell kind humans. For example, in Wainanzi, it is said that Wang Di obtained the map of Bayes and used it to control various monsters. If Bayes were to fight against King Kong or Godzilla, it might use its knowledge or kindness to impress or guide the opponent. Number 5. Changming Bird is a legendary divine bird in ancient Chinese mythology, resembling a chicken but with a phoenix-like voice. It appears in the Shanghai Jing's Eastern Wilderness Classic, and lives in the land of the Aurora in the east. The most special thing about Changming Bird is that it has two pupils in each eye, hence its name. It is said that Changming Bird can see through all truths and secrets, and can predict the future and disasters. If it were to fight against King Kong or Godzilla, it might use its keenness or foresight to avoid or prevent the opponent's attacks. Number 4. Ying Long is a winged dragon in legend, regarded as the god of rain and water in ancient China. It appears in the Shanghai Jing's northeast corner of the Wilderness Classic and lives north of the Chishui River. Ying Long is very powerful and mighty, capable of causing clouds and rain and adjusting the climate of heaven and earth. In Shanghai Jing, it is said that it once killed Qiyu and Kuafu, two strong men in ancient times. Later, 
Ying Long was obtained by Wang Di, who helped him defeat Yandi and Qiyu and establish the foundation of the Chinese nation. If it were to fight against King Kong or Godzilla, it might use its flying or rain-making abilities to attack or trap the opponent. Number 3. Teoti is one of the four ancient fierce beasts and the most greedy one. It appears in the Shan Haijing's Western Wilderness Classic and lives in the extreme darkness of the West. The image of Teoti is that of a monster with only a head and no body, because it is too good at eating and even ate its own body. It can swallow all living creatures, whether humans or divine beasts. The image of Teoti also often appears as a decoration on ancient bronze ware. If it were to fight against King Kong or Godzilla, it might use its enormous size or greed to devour or tear apart the opponent. Number 2. Zhu Long is a divine beast with a human face and snake body, with red skin, living in the extreme cold of the north. It appears in the Shan Haijing's Northern Wilderness Classic and lives north of the Qishui River. Zhu Long has the power to control the brightness of heaven and earth. As long as it opens its eyes, it is daylight. When it closes its eyes, it is night. Some people believe that Zhu Long may be the prototype of Pangu, because Pangu also has a similar ability. If it were to fight against King Kong or Godzilla, it might use its light or darkness to illuminate or obscure the opponent. Number 1. Baze is a famous divine creature on the Kunlun Mountain. Its body is pure white, and it can speak human language and understand the emotions of all living things. Baze rarely appears, and it is known to reside on the Kunlun Mountain in the Classic of Mountains and Seas, which is the Heavenly Emperor's capital. Baze knows the secrets and weaknesses of all strange things between heaven and earth and is willing to tell kind-hearted humans about them. For example, the Wainanzi says that the Yellow Emperor obtained Baze's chart and used it to subdue various monsters. Why does Baze rank first? Because it not only has infinite wisdom and kindness but also has extraordinary abilities and demeanor beyond ordinary people. Unlike other divine creatures that rely on force or magic to solve problems, Baze uses reason and morality to guide humanity towards civilization and progress. If it were to fight against King Kong or Godzilla, it might persuade or educate them with its wisdom or morals. These magical creatures are not only described in great detail in the Shan Hai Jin, but also play a crucial role in traditional Chinese culture. Whether it's their power, appearance, or cultural significance, these divine creatures are worth exploring and understanding deeply. So, who do you think would win between the top 10 divine creatures in China and Western King Kong or Godzilla? Please leave a comment in the comments section and share your thoughts. If you want to learn more about the Shan Hai Jin or other ancient Chinese myths and legends, please follow my channel and turn on the bell icon so that you won't miss my updates. Thank you for watching and supporting me. See you next time.